birds. In the prayer session, all the students, teachers and family members come together and seek blessings. This togetherness creates an atmosphere of love, affection and respect. After prayer, there is a study hour and physical training which includes drill, yoga sana, etc. Now that they are tired, they head straight for the dining hall. The food is simple but nutritious. This is the school assembly. Being a remote place and devoid of the gifts of information technology, the students listen to the news very attentively after the assembly. Teachers explain and brief the students in the classes about the happenings of national interest. The classes are very vibrant and interactive. Importance is given to learning by doing. The students too enjoy doing a lot of work like cleaning the hostel blocks, gardening, etc. Games and sports is part and parcel of the daily activity and in the VKV routine, sports and games are given due importance. To channelize the energy and skills of the children and to develop a good physique for them, the VKVs have been making systematic efforts. The school routine therefore includes morning PT, evening games, malkamb, gymnastics, etc. It is done with the objective of developing physical fitness and discipline amongst the students and also to develop a sportsman spirit. The students are quite strong and they like adventurous sports. Jumping through a ring of fire is cakewalk for them. In the evening, there is a bhajan sandhya, when they sit in a serene and divine environment created by the rendering of bhajans. It helps them in calming down their emotions. Then there is the study hour wherein the teachers help the students in their homework and assignments. Health care and hygiene is also paid due attention. With the broad objective of taking the VKV boys to the national level in sports, an attempt was made to form an all-VKV football team. A football tournament for all the 22 VKVs of Arunachal Pradesh was started with a prestigious trophy instituted in the name of the founding father of VKVs, Mananiya Eknaji Ranade. Regular training in military band is given. This training is imparted with the broad objective of inculcating a sense of discipline and to take pride in the defense forces of their motherland. The VKV Niosa band has earned a name and a place of privilege for itself due to its high benchmark level of performance. The VKV Niosa band is invited every year to perform at the district headquarters and the subdivisional headquarters on national festivals. It has been a traditional belief in India that nature and the land where we live provide the right food that the body needs at the right time and in correct dosages. The students of VKV Nyosa have also developed a kitchen garden for themselves. The boarders set aside a few hours for cultivating vegetables or helping the bhaiyas in preparing the land for sowing which, besides being a part of the work session in the school, is also a thing of joy for them. Normally, the bhaiyas prepare the land for cultivation and then the students take over and do the rest. All the important national festivals are celebrated in the school campus with pomp and gaiety in order to develop integrity among all and also to know and understand the diversified culture and customs of their motherland. Not to mention the local festivals of Arunachal Pradesh which are observed with due importance. Vivekananda Kendra Vidyalaya Nyosa is a unique school catering to the needs of the economically weaker sections of the Tirab district in Arunachal Pradesh. Communication link remains snapped every now and then either due to incessant rains or due to insurgent activities prevalent in this part. For medical assistance, 
The teachers used to carry the students for 12 kilometers. But now, due to the magnanimity of Hindustan Petroleum Corporation Limited, this Igani has become history. The corporation has donated a pickup van to the school. It is a great relief to the school and the Neosa villagers too. The army troops deployed nearby Neosa are always ready to provide the necessary succor. The students and the teachers feel very happy when someone visits the school. Though the visits are very rare and sparse, but the visitors' feedback is always encouraging because the simple and humble hospitality extended at such a remote corner away from the hustle and bustle of urban life does have an attraction for one and all. Oh.